Hello Talk family and thank you so much for joining me on another episode of Talk the Talk. I'm your host, Desh Belay Betchen, and joining me today is Leroy Potkider, and he is the Product Manager NIC Sales at MFC. Now, MFC, a division of NetBank, has been our supporters for the longest time ever. It's actually five years this year. We are seeing the five-year anniversary for the Motrink Woman of the Year Awards. Leroy can be described as a courageous, resilient and innovative individual. Now I know that personally because he jumped on board last year um, and started with all of my um, design work and everything related to um, the look and the feel of MOT. Leroy has worked hard to achieve his goals personally as well at um, MFC and along the way motivate and encourage his team and his colleagues, especially his fellow female colleagues. Leroy works for MFC, as I said, one of our sponsors, but he's here today to chat to us about his role and uh, share his opinion about our initiatives. Um, and I can say this without a shadow of a doubt. He is extremely passionate about what we do here at um, Women in Motoring South Africa. So, without further ado, let's welcome Leroy. And this interview is proudly brought to you by Seriti Solutions, MFC, and Evo by NetBank. Hey, Leroy. Hey, Desh. <laughs> so, Leroy, it was so amazing talking to you off air. Uh, I know you share such an amazing passion for what we do, and I just thank you so much for that. Thank you, Tish, and thank you for inviting me here today. It's a real pleasure being here. Mm -hmm. um, very excited of what's going to happen this year. Um, I think we had a great event last year, so happy to kick things off for the year. Yeah, definitely. I mean, um, when, when you first met me and, and you saw my logos, everything was in pink and yellow. And like, Tish, listen, we need to do, like, kind of put some corporateness into this. <laughs> okay, and, and you really changed the look and the feel of, um, you know, our invites and, and our visuals. And I think Thank you so much for that. Oh, it's only a pleasure, Tish. Thank you. I'm so happy to, that I'm able to actually assist in that regard. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, there is obviously always this type of standard that we have to hold. Mm -hmm. And I mean, you make it easy with all of your inputs and working together with us to put out uh, something that is visually aesthetically pleasing for it. Mm -hmm. um, and to have a, a, an event in the end of the day that is so well received where everyone enjoyed themselves to the fullest. Absolutely. So tell our viewers more about yourself, Leroy, and your position at MFC. So I've lived in Pretoria most of my life. Um, away from work, I'm married to a beautiful woman and I'm a father to the most amazing daughter. Mm -hmm. I have a passion for golf and all other sports and I love spending my free time in the bush. Oh. <laughs> I have been with MFC now for the past 16 years, starting at the very bottom, mm -hmm. spending most of my career in operations, which we refer to as the engine room of the business. Mm -hmm. Um, about six months ago, I joined the sales team as a product manager and as a product manager, uh, and my role is working with all of the various contributors of the business mm -hmm. um, to identify and, and deliver a product which enables our dealer partners to provide valued offerings to, to the end of consumers. Hmm, that's a mouthful, hey? so you do quite a bit. <laughs> what else is there? So Desh, uh, vehicle finance is an essential product which enables people from all walks of life mm -hmm. uh, to follow their dreams and make their prospects a reality. Absolutely. What's your opinion though, Leroy, um, taking a little bit away from MFC? I know MFC and MWOTI are in this together to bring um, delight and recognition, upliftment and empowerment to all women in the motoring trade. But what is your personal opinion in terms of what we are doing uh, in the motoring trade as a platform? So I think it's a wonderful initiative that you have brought forward with women in motoring and driving the MWT and recognizing women. Uh, you are really helping to close the equality gap mm -hmm. and address the concern of gender-based violence. Absolutely. Importantly, you also give rise to the voice of the women in, in our society. And I am a firm believer that there should exist no division between genders. All people should be judged by their ability and passion towards the task at hand. Mm -hmm. No women should have any fear of, and for, of any form 
of, mm. of gender discrimination. Absolutely, and I think as a father and as a husband, as you said, to a beautiful wife, you are definitely in this for the long haul, right? Most definitely, <laughs> yes. So what was your actual experience um, at the um, emoti function last year? How did you feel? Just give us your take on it. Well, first of all, Desha, I'm just so grateful to have been part of the organizing team at last year's event. Mm -hmm. Are uh, you sure you were grateful? Because, I mean, we set up sometimes to midnight trying to get logos right. No, definitely. <laughs> I'm, I'm very grateful. And I mean, November as well, it's not the easiest time mm -hmm. of the year. That's where the ball really starts getting rolling forward in terms of being busy, in terms of production. Mm -hmm. um, but you know, without sounding biased, mm -hmm. I believe the event was an unforgettable occasion. Mm -hmm. The venue was fantastic. We had great food. The party was awesome. <laughs> we had some of the biggest names in the industry in attendance. Mm -hmm. But for me, what stood out most was the passion and the gratitude shown by all of the women that attended. Uh, most of the women that I spoke to were so ecstatic for being recognized for all of their excellent achievements. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And I'm looking, as, as I've mentioned before, I'm looking so much forward to the fifth anniversary it's of Morty. Absolutely, and it's we have such a diverse uh, team um, from the Morty side, from my side as well. Oh, sorry, from the Morty side and from MFC side, sorry. Um, we have females, we have males, we have every um, different race on our team. and. Coming together with all of our ideas and contribution in terms of what the event should look like is absolutely refreshing and incredible, right? Isn't it just amazing? Absolutely. I think you've hit the nail on the head. Uh -huh. um, it was a really excellent event as we've um, spoke about now and uh -huh. the diversity was immense. We had people from all genders, from all races participating and giving their all. Yeah. And together as a team, we really made it happen. Yeah, we did. And I think now we've just set the bar and now moving forward it's about not just going over that bar but setting the bar to a new standard altogether again. Absolutely and look again this is the only awards program in motoring in the world not just in South Africa, in the world like this. So it's so important for us, as you said, to set the bar, but be the example and the change that we wish to see um, in the world, globally, not just nationally. So yeah, that's incredible. How does it feel though to be actively, I mean, you did speak about being actively involved, but this year it's on a different, um, um, landscape altogether. Reason being, last year you were just pulled into it. It was just a month or two before the event. But now, you know, having more awareness and more understanding of the initiative, um, how does it feel to be actively involved from the beginning? Nadesh, <laughs> it, it's an honor to have the opportunity to be involved with these initiatives. Mm -hmm. Although we have come a long way in closing the equality gap, uh, we can never do enough to cement this vision um, in the way society moves forward. Uh, you have my full support in, in the continuous drive uh, to empower women and leveling the playing field in this industry that has always been predominantly dominated by, by men. Um, if, if we work together on these initiatives and we continue this drive, uh, then we will have the opportunity to really level this okay. landscape. Absolutely. You know, I just want to say thank you so much, Leroy, because um, I'm one of the very blessed recipients of a sponsor um, from a corporate like NetBank or MFC by NetBank and Evo by NetBank and Seriti Solutions, where my sponsors are physically, um, you know, involved in the initiative. It's not just a financial contribution, but it is a contribution on every single level, you know, throughout um, and across the spectrum of bringing this event together. Thank you, Leroy, for joining me. Thank you for being a part of this. Thank you, Tesh. However, it's been, I've been really nervous to be here on camera. <laughs> It's really been a welcoming experience. Mm -hmm. You really do make this much easier than it seems. <laughs> and thank you, it's been a pleasure. And you, like I said, you've got my full support and MFC's full support Aww. to make things happen and 
pave the way for an equal society where there's no discrimination between genders and where we all can move forward holistically and create a better South Africa. Thank you. Thank you so much, Leroy. Thank you, Desh. Viewers, we would like to thank you for your continued support and encourage you to like and share our content. Our non-profit companies, the Motoring Woman of the Year Awards, powered by MFC and Evo by NetBank, and the Talk the Talk Studios, sponsored by Seriti Solutions and Evo by NetBank, are platforms aimed at empowering, uplifting and celebrating the women of motoring South Africa. We are not just telling stories, we are changing lives. If you are searching for a new or pre-owned vehicle, please visit www.auto.evo.africa. We have a wide range of vehicles on sale for you to choose from. And we only advertise on behalf of reliable and trustworthy MFC accredited dealerships. This car listing portal is user friendly and you can also find vehicle reviews, car maintenance tips and automotive advice all courtesy of Talk the Talk Studios. So ladies, having said that, um, if you want to thrive instead of just survive, you will need the mindset um, and business tactics to embrace change. The first step is to get your internal strategy right. Are you seeing yourself as a victim of the future or an architect of it? Change is not always a negative thing. In fact, change is necessary for growth in all aspects of life. Um, a quote from my guru, Satguru, if you resist change, you resist life. Now we've spoken about the trajectory that we want to see change in our industry and it's so important for us as women and men to embrace this change and men like Leroy that has pled or pledged their support for us is so important because we are looking for gentlemen to stand in solidarity with us to be the catalyst for change to champion for what we want to see change in terms of transformation in terms of women moving up the ranks moving into these leadership positions and just being um, powerful powerful in their own right in our trade especially and with that i would like to remind you that the question should never be who's going to let me it should always be who's going to stop me mm -hmm.